Hey, we're recording right now. The Zoom <laughs> lady just said it. Recording in progress. The kindness games. <laughs> Overtime. Oh, you even cut the microphone. That's when you know oh, that's no. next level overtime. <laughs> when the mic says, like, I can't handle it. Bring well, the heat, you know? Oh, thank you. Thank you. I try. How are you doing? What have you been up to today? I'm good. I have been at Excel Rise all day. Oh. Young Professional Security Conference. If you do not know what Accelerize is, you're either not in the security industry or you're not really in the security industry. <laughs> Accelerize done by SIA is the only young professionals conference for the security industry, for security professionals who happen to be young. Not Pretty awesome. like myself. That's where I met Tim three years ago in person. We did meet there. How <laughs> fortuitous. I think that's how you use that word. Yeah. Yeah. That's yeah, so that funny. Was, that oh was a God. fun little, uh, little like meeting somebody. I know. Do you recall how it happened? I do. <laughs> yeah. In true Kelsey fashion, walks up to a random person, starts talking. <laughs> she says, hey, have we met? I was like, no, I don't think so. She's like, I'm Kelsey. I was like, <laughs> Okay. <laughs> and look at that. Three years later. <laughs> Three years later, we bonded over our love of Jeeps. Accurate. And we bonded over our love of kindness. True. And Tim is totally a mentor of mine. I've deemed him a mentor <laughs> well, and friend. Yeah, you did do that little shout out to me earlier. That's an interesting thing, Kelsey. What do you call that thing that you do? Like kudos? Yeah, so like LinkedIn prompts you, which they're what? prompting you to be kind. It's pretty great. No, Doesn't but it's like me. when you have a connection anniversary with someone. So like we'd been connected for three years really? and it was weird because it was right around the same time of Accelerize. So you can give like shout outs to people. I didn't know that because you yeah. do them all the time. <laughs> I almost think we should bring Count your them? kudos into the kindness game. <laughs> That, that would almost keep you on track with me. I know. Go ahead. Publicly shame me. No, you have no, like a hundred no, more no, posts no. than me. You're super kind. There's no public shaming. But actually, we need to talk to Lee about that <laughs> to see if that, that might work. I'm the LinkedIn kudos may work after you've done your 30 post journey. We're going to find out. We're going to make a ruling on that. <laughs> <laughs> the jury's out. The jury's out. <laughs> All right, August 24th, 2021. Dude, August is almost over. I mean, 2021 is almost over. It's crazy. I feel like as slow as each month has been, it's completely flown by. Yeah. Like, I feel like some days are really slow. You're like, oh my God, we're still in this pandemic, kind of, but we're half out. And then you're like, but it's fall almost? How? Do you know why the end of August is such an exciting time? Um, I mean, fall is my favorite season. No, I'm just kidding. Um, <laughs> because the kindness game started around you that time, what? right? The kindness games did start in September, but you know what else? Even more important than the kindness games could ever be hockey season. Oh, training camp kicks off in September. Preseason kicks off in September. The season kicks off in October, and that's what makes life truly living worth living. <laughs> yeah. Or you get your Jeep soon, right? That's coming soon. I hope so. I hope so. I don't have a, a delivery. Date <laughs> it's about to be your favorite month forever. Yeah, I'm for so sure. If my Jeep comes in September, game on. Best month ever. <laughs> All right. Here's what we got on this scoreboard. We're not going to run through uh, the list. You know why we're not going to run through the list? There's so many people. There's 77 so many people doing the kind of or have started the kindness games. They're not all doing the kindness games. Some have done it. Some have started and not finished. Um, but yeah, we have 77 people in less than a year, which is kind of ridiculous. So cool. We're still trying for 100 by the end of the year. So we shout have, out to the sideliners. Yeah, we have set a record in August of 2021. 
I believe this is the the most new people we have had come into the kindness games ever in a single month. Twelve new participants this month. It's crazy. That is crazy. Twelve is my favorite number. Sidebar. Maybe because it's becoming the end of summer and fall is coming and they're seeing the change of the leaves. People are like, maybe I too should bring a new <laughs> leaf and join the community. What do you think? Total mic drop right there. You can't follow that. <laughs> That's awesome. Uh, we have 12 new participants uh, and we're going to talk about each one of them. Uh, but we have three journeys to watch. So three journeys to watch. Journeys to watch are like people that are over 20 posts out of their initial 30. So they're closing in. Patrick Fitzgibbons. Do you know why I said his name like that? It's a total radio voice. It's, it's, it's contrary to his beautiful voice that I cannot <laughs> replicate. So I say Fitzgibbons. Just to let him know, I'm jealous. He's at 25. I feel like Josh Ledesma gives him a, a run for his money. Josh has a very radio voice as well. It, Josh has like an NPR voice, right? <laughs> He's like very like smooth. <laughs> Patrick Fitzgibbons has that voice that engages you and like drives your brain. You're like, yeah, keep talking, man. I need that drug. That voice. It's amazing. Uh, number two in the journeys to watch, Carla Eisenberg at 23. Very awesome. My favorite story, wasn't she? The one that we didn't know was joining. And then all of a sudden, 17th post. left field. I love that. She flew under the radar, didn't tag anybody. She was brought in by, um, by uh, Lisa. Angela. 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 Angela yep. Scalpella had a, a brain fart there. And Patrick Fitzgibbons was brought in by Playground Bill Massey. Love it. Yep. And Janet Fenner is at 23, and she's just kind of taking her time. So she probably won't finish by the time we do the next scoreboard, but I think she might finish this year. See how it goes. But Janet's, Janet's reached out to me. She's like, I'm taking my time. I'm being intentional with my kindness, and that is fine. Yeah, you can totally well, tell how. You can tell how intentional she is too. And she's roping in people in her posts and it's super cool. She is Again, everybody camera. putting their own spin. Yep. Movers and shakers, the most active people in the kindness games right now. Tim Wenzel. Who's that? <laughs> how Today many are you at Tim? 150th, the kindness games post. This scoreboard right here. What? I have just closed out quadruple overtime. So my next post after this video will be my first of five overtime, quintuple. <laughs> overtime. That's insane. That's awesome. Yeah. Good um, for you, buddy. Lee Outen has been on a rash. He's done seven days of kindness and he has called out somebody for the last seven days. And you know what? He also has a beautiful voice, although it's Australian, and yet he's British. <laughs> I love his animations and his videos. There's like things blown up all over the place. I don't know how he does that. He takes too much time. <laughs> Me, I'm just like, record it, send it. <laughs> all right, Mike Gips, everybody. The amazing Gips is at 19 posts, so he is just outside of the journeys to watch. He may never get to the journeys to watch because he might finish before we do our next scoreboard. That'd be awesome. Diana Keeble, Di Keeble from Australia, our only, our actual Australian, Lee. <laughs> She's at 17 and uh, I don't know, I don't do math that well, but she also may never actually land in the journeys to watch if she keeps up with this. Mm -hmm. She's doing every single day too. Yeah. So. Um, Jake Edwards. He is at four, um, but I have it on pretty good authority that he's going to be posting one tomorrow. That you may be in, I'm <laughs> sensing. 
<laughs> You're like, I'm actually posting that and he's resharing it. <laughs> Sorry, blew your cover. <laughs> uh, Connie Ryan brought in by SMB. You know who SMB is? Small medium business is the only thing that pops in my head. Sarah Marie Baumgartner, but it's oh, just so long. Is that, do people call her that? Is that a nickname? Well, that's I'm not aware name. of. I was corrected. She does not go by Sarah. It's Sarah Marie. Sarah Marie. Okay. So gotcha. SMB for me. Love it. That's how I'm going to do She's a it. rock star. Yep. Connie Ryan is also a rock star. I got to chat with her. Very and, cool. And uh, she is just the coolest person. Um, by the way, Kelsey, have you talked to her yet? I'm overdue. Her and her husband. For both of them. Oh, <gasps> really? They go off roading with their Wrangler. What? What? Oh, wow. Yeah, that sounds like a party. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> That's awesome. Sarah Marie and her, I need to reach out to for sure. So. Um, Bertrand Petit. I hope I said your name right, Bertrand. If you don't know, I destroy everybody's names. Uh, <laughs> but he's at four. He was brought in by Paul Moxness, and he is in Monaco. So cool. Right? I love it. I love all these alumni that are bringing people with them. Like they rose to the challenge that you post to everybody. I think it was on another scoreboard, right? I'll tell you what, we have had 12 people join um, and then they were brought in by five different people, I believe. So cool. So the alumni are stepping up. Lisa. And leading by example. There we go. For sure. Kindness. Uh, uh, Eva Doherty Grimmert, again, with the names. <laughs> Sorry, Eva. I know we're friends, and yet I don't know how to say your name. Whatever. I've never <laughs> met you in real life. It's just one of those things. She's at three. Funny story. Um, she and I have been hanging out doing wild leader stuff for about a year, but she joined because of Coach Cat. So, oh, good. you know what? I wouldn't take me seriously either. <laughs> all in good fun. So, yeah, she's probably like, Tim's crazy, but Coach Cat, she, <laughs> like, she has a reputation. Like, I'll, I'll do what she's doing. Thank you, Coach Cat. You're so nice. Uh, Natasha Ryan is at three. Um, and she is very cool. And she has already recruited somebody. Yeah. Who will I'm be her posts, their huh? kindness games debut tomorrow? Ooh. So I she love that she posts in and she's recruiting people. What's so going cool. on, everybody? I love Natasha brought her daughter for one of them. And so you know, I'm a super fan of like pulling everybody else in. Did you notice anything in that video with her daughter? Um, she threw up a peace sign and I love it. <laughs> peace out. But when her mom asked her, What are we doing? and she said the kindness games. She said it to the theme of overtime. She said, oh, she did. Yes. The I was like, games. Yeah. Yeah. I also like the first timer. Was that it? First time. Yep. Yeah. First time. That's awesome. <laughs> so overtime. That was awesome. Uh, so Natasha's funny. cool. She actually interviewed us, right? Mm -hmm. And uh, in the next week or so, that interview is going to go live. And that's going to be fun. I can't really wait for cool. that. Yeah. Tim McCreet is at two. I saw that. So he, love it. he's on track for one a week right now. And uh, I love that guy. He's really invested so much in me. And he hasn't had to. He's awesome. Such a nice Very well spoken. Very. Yeah. Canadian. Yeah. yeah. Canadian. <laughs> yeah. He's always, he's always got his, you know, words. I'm like, oh, there it goes. Hey. Yeah, <laughs> but I think that's the reason why he's so kind. Actually, I mean, he's just very gracious with his time. So. Yeah, he's awesome. Tim McCray, we have Dean McKay, also somebody I've met through Wild Leaders, and and Coach Cat and I both kicked him off, although he came to me. So whatever. Sure Some people <laughs> think I have credibility. And then uh, HH is at one. So that's awesome, right? It's incredible people this month if we keep that up we're gonna get to 100 that's well, the goal we gotta get there i would love to have by the end of 2021 50 alumni oh yeah 
We're at 27 right now. So 23 yeah. more? Something like that. It's like that math. I was like, no. one, two, three. No. <laughs> Other 10 fingers. Dang. <laughs> awesome. That's oh, super well, exciting. Do you have a thought to close us out with? Yeah. I mean, I think it's inspirational to see everybody that's joining. And there are so many, I think the coolest part about all these people who have, not all, but a good chunk of the people who have joined, some of them we didn't know about, but they were also in the the stands. They were watching yeah. for a while, which I think is super cool because it's a little bit intimidating. I mean, I, I you saw my first video, right? It becomes so normal so quickly though, because this is a life we've all been living, right? We've all been working remote or on a bunch of video calls forever in the past year and a half. So it's normalized. So I think that people are really becoming more comfortable with the uncomfortable. And I think that kindness and the curiosity of what this is and the movement that it really has become is appealing to people. People are curious enough to make the jump because I've really, I've noticed like a lot of these names are really familiar and I've seen their posts, but I've also seen them like and comment on a lot too. So mm -hmm. I think it's just inspirational and everybody keep, keep on doing what you're doing. Yeah. Um, I think that it's your testament to the life we're living and the necessary kindness that needs to be thrown around. Kindness is necessary and it does need to be spread. And uh, yeah, I uh, was picking up on your MCing skills today at Accelerize. <laughs> and it seems like the kindness game has up your virtual game. It's true. It's very yeah. true. I can speak to myself like nobody's tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> I'm comfortable talking to a wall now. It's cool. <laughs> I've never spoken to nobody as well as I do now. The you said that. Game. You totally said that before. And it's like, it's true. Because it's when true. you're talking to a screen, you're seeing yourself. It's your passion totally comes through too. I saw that in some presentations. Yeah. It's like, and if you can't see the people or like they're too small tiles because there's too many people, it doesn't matter because I talk to me all day long. It's <laughs> awesome. Tim, awesome. you're always good for a good laugh. Hey, you know what? <laughs> Life's too long not to have fun. It's true. Kindness games out. <laughs>